Hello, everybody. I think I understand what my problem was with vanilla carriers. Uh, it involves engine to weight ratios, and I'm pretty sure I've got it solved. So I produced some test carriers that were really kick ass. Uh, but I'm focusing more on small carriers due to those aforementioned thrust to weight ratios. So this is uh, a demonstration of the new chunk of the carrier that I'll be putting on the front, I think. This is a 12 small unit, one large unit carrier piece, as you can see, with four Gatling turrets. The drones come in and land in here, and it's a super, super lightweight landing bay. Uh, but it is, is fairly well armored, so uh, although the maximum drone size is quite small, the end result is that the drones are well protected and the carrier weighs almost nothing. Over here is the interface I've designed for that 12 unit carrier, or 13 unit, and this is what it looks like. As you can see, there is still one screen per drone. I can't really do anything about that. Um, uh, there are no drones loaded in, so all the screens are blank. But here is the way we can try and tell which drones are on and which drones are off. I may take some pains to hide this away a little bit better, but it doesn't really matter. And if you click these, you can see that you can activate or deactivate various drones as you see fit. And this one activates or deactivates that front drone. And this uses um, about one-eighth of the space that the uh, system that used all large ship parts did. I didn't realize how small these buttons were. I was thinking that four of these buttons in a row would be the same size as a normal panel, a button panel, and that might be basically true, but they don't take up any friggin' vertical space, so I can crowd them in real, real tight like this. Uh, and it's a huge, huge space saver. In addition, the ability to display which drones are on in the same uh, visual style of the actual landing deck seems to be a big win. The idea is here you can actually see which drones are active uh, by simply this is a physical representation of what was back here. So you can get a real idea for what you're looking at. And I think that's a pretty good way to do it. Um, I'd like to hear your opinions. Oh, what are you doing? Yeah, I'd like to hear your opinions on the matter. Uh, I'm going to go with small carriers because in vanilla they make a lot more sense. Uh, and the small carriers I designed to run uh, ended up looking really, really ugly, so I deleted them. But now that I understand how engine loadouts work, I'm pretty sure I can build some kick-ass small carriers. Very, very lightweight parking. Compact cars only.